Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 Millennium Dawn with me, Alpha File Mega and Iran. So, I'd like to say that we are doing kinda good considering that uh, we are in what can be seen as the doomsday battle for our existence. Uh, but we have barely started, that's the issue. It's 28th of May and I think that the war was declared something on like the 15th, so only 14 days have passed since like half of the world, or you know, half of the important world declared war on us. It's kind of interesting coalition of the building, you know, you have the United States, you have France, United Kingdom, and the Netherlands, Slovakia, <laughs> Slovenia, and uh, Egypt. That's that's an interesting coalition, but I mean, all jokes aside, it's a terrifying coalition because just Germany. Wait, was it Germany or France? Okay, France, 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 France. I just hope they won't call Germany because you know, then it would be all screwed up. Anyway, we managed to eliminate uh, the American forces near Eskisha here, and now our forces are moving to the desert where we're gonna try to. Push in there. We're also fighting here near Kuwait City. We're trying to push there, well, push the enemies out of here. So we'll see how it's gonna work. Our things are doing kind of good. I was actually considering attacking over here. The American division is moving out, so in case they move out, we might attack it because I just see two weak units, and opening another line would give us some more of an attack on this area, so we'll see if that would be possible. Okay, let's hear it for the insufficient resources. Well, oh, I'm really interested what the uh, Russian units are going to... Oh, come on. Come the hell on. I have no idea what we'll need, so we need to let it run for a bit until the game reinitializes. But this battle is looking pretty good. Look at the damage that we're doing. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, I feel like we're really hurting them here. Which is, yeah, we're definitely doing major damage here. So good, our divisions work. Which is great news. Better than what you would expect normally, but we're having major issues. Okay, that's because Russia is out and Bulgaria is out. For some reason, Bulgaria will trade us. Okay, this will allow me to stop trading with Argentina and Indonesia. I have a feeling... Uh, well, you can actually give me slightly more. And it will allow me to import less from China. And we can import less from Russia as well. Okay, so a bit of min-maxing over there. How are you guys doing? Moving. Okay, cool. And we're starting to get a little bit of manpower. But just a tiny little bit, not much. Okay, we have 62 political power. Is that enough? Yes. We can move to sizable military spending and further... Mm, Bury our nation in debt. <laughs> oh God! Uh, but it's gonna work. We need more factories on aircraft, by the way. That's what we definitely need to do. Snap! Was that a naval battle? We have a lot of our ships. Okay, so we have 24 ships now, 16 corvettes, one, fr one frigate, 5 cruisers, and 2 helicopter operators. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, you go, guys. So this one moves out in one hour. These ones move out in seven hours. And there's a Saudi Arabia mechanized bucket moving. Oh, snap. They're moving a lot of forces around here. I don't like it. There's nothing we can do, really. Nothing we can do, really. So, wait, you guys are not doing anything, huh? Okay, well, we're gonna let you repair before we do something more, but. Okay, you're pushed out. And yeah, I don't have many good units facing us. We're just taking crippling damage, hopefully. If you guys could kind of move out, that would be great. Okay, so what's going on here? Iraq wants to join... Okay, hold on. They can't because I think that Iraq is already at war with Saudi Arabia. Yep, and we really do not want to get you involved in the war against everyone else because that would open a whole new border and I'm not ready for that. And neither are you, if we're frank. If the American forces could stop moving around here. Uh, they won't. Snap. Well, Pakistan sets, nu sets nuclear forces on alert. Okay, well, that's great. Amazing job. And someone is attacking us. It's the AI Motorized Marine Division. And that's fun because the units that are defending are considered being in the fight even if they aren't. So 72nd and 46th Mechanized Brigade. Okay, so 72nd and 36th. I have to be here somewhere. Wait, so the second and for the sixth. Okay. Let's stop here and just repel them. Yeah, that's an attack that's gonna be fun to break. You do have a really huge ton of organization here though. So we need to be really careful. Oh god, they reinforced the entire border. Jesus. That's bad. I was really hoping we might have what it takes, but... Uh, this might not... Yeah, they're just throwing units in. This might not happen. This might not happen. Okay, but you know what? We can test the rockets now. Kuwait and Qatar. Yeah, Bahrain. Bahrain was supposed to join us. Turns out it won't. So let me see. We wanted to launch rockets. So we're gonna launch the Shahab 5 with the incendiary armor. Okay. We'll set you as... Wait, we don't have any... No, we do. Okay, select target point. 
So I selected launch point. Okay. Target. And and fire. Okay, let's see if it does any damage. We haven't shot a single one yet. So I don't know how that's how that works, but And you have no chance, guys. Just wasting your time. The bad part is... So are we, really. No, the sim on the forces... There isn't much of a chance that we would break through. Uh, but we can try. Okay, free dockyards. So we can start upgrading our cruisers. Or another cruiser, that is. Yeah, there's nothing to upgrade. Uh, nothing else to upgrade, so you're gonna go for an upgrade. And it looks like we're. Yeah, it looks like we're missing a. Oh my god, why are you doing this? Jesus Christ. Why do you keep screwing up with my deliveries? I was hoping that attack might have a chance, but no such luck. Have we finished the rockets already? No, still 376 to be done. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. And look at the damage. They are really doing a ton of it. Yeah. I'm disrupting a lot of their airplanes. I think we might put more of you out there. Just for the sake of interrupting more of them. Actually this airfield needs to be upgraded. We don't have enough size in here. So let's put it as a priority. Yeah, that's cheap. That's gonna be done in a couple of days. Oh, our attack over there is going very well. You guys are planning. So plan away. You guys repel this attack. And we can continue with this. I mean... It's looking better, their forces are definitely getting damaged and hurt, but... From Isfahan to Kuwait. When is it going to be launched? Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, either way, the damage is being done. Yep, we're getting a decent amount of men now. Jesus. Yeah, the Kuwaiti forces are definitely suffering here. So we'll see how they're, they'll do. Twenty percent. Okay, then anything. Putting an Anatolia in Iran. Yep. 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 I'm aware of the bombing and the screaming. Interception. Yeah, you don't have the range to. Oh, but this is looking good. We're shooting down more and killing more, even though so are they. But I mean, at least it's fair now. We shot down four, we shot down two. Oh, great. We are already at two trillion depth again. How amazing is that? Okay, they're throwing you at us again. Oh, sure. Job with that. I mean, we're entrenched, you cannot pierce us. I have higher stats. And Hassan Saadi is a better commander. I mean, you know, this might have a chance at happening. Our units are fairly weakened, so we'll see. Let's speed it up a bit. So far, it seems like we are not in imminent danger. Okay, why are your divisions over there? That I do not understand. But nor do I need to. Okay, this is the first time when they actually have all of their units in the fight. And we might start pushing them out. Okay, you guys have the maxed out bonus. Oh! Oh no. I can already see this is probably not gonna happen. Well, inferior enemy 80%. Did we shoot the rocket or what was that alert? Total damage free. Did we hit them? I don't know what happened. Okay, once this attack breaks, we're launching our attack. We'll just hope we have a chance. I mean, the game seems to think so. So I'll just let them attack and we'll see what's gonna happen. Okay, two of the tank divisions have been knocked out, but we have a number of reserves, so it's not like we have an issue here. And while they keep reinforcing with their units, their units do not have enough time to recuperate, so this really might happen to us. We'll see. Oh god, we're taking a row of heavy casualties here. Okay, but so are they. I mean, 
this is really not a good place to fight for us, but... Ricey won. Good. Yeah, look at that. We're really hurting them. So it might eventually happen to us that we'll hurt them so much that we'll be able to push them. And this one also seems to be winnable. I mean, there really isn't much that you cannot do if you just throw human suffering at it for a long enough time. Okay. Some more trusty floor. And the enemy disruption going. Oh god. Uh, I feel the pain of the nation. Eighty percent. I don't know, the game seems to think that we might do it. Okay, Air Doctrine. And Naval Mission Efficiency, Strategic Bomber. Okay, Attack Helicopter, Ground Attack, Rotary Wing Frontier Focus. Short combat, radi and lower airspeed compared to a fixed wing asset make helicopters less suitable for deep strikes. As such, tactics for maximizing their effectiveness in providing direct air support to frontline troops are developed. Okay. I don't think we have any airfield here from where we could launch the helicopters, but I'll still try. Yeah, that's that's pathetic. But if we actually take this area, we might put the helicopters there. Okay, how many airplanes do we have here? 449 out of 600. So I can deploy one more air wing of the third generation aircraft. So you guys deploy interception. Every single aircraft is really good for us. Yeah, look at that. We lost two and they lost Six. I need to build some radars as well. Okay, 3%. And I threw in more units, but just look at that. Their units are getting super weakened. 81%. Four, two. Well, the casualties guys still pretty good. I'm not surprised by that. Now we have a much more experienced general, so that also plays a role. Nah, uh, but I don't think I mean these fights are the best we can do at this point. They're fair and square. As is the fight in the north. Oh my god. Please stop. We need more radars. Jesus Christ. Okay, 79%. 49%. Yeah, but they throw their reserves in. They are quicker pushed out. So what we need to do is hurt every single one of these units so that they lose their organization. And then we might have a chance. Expert organizer, max planning bonus. Sure, why not? It's a bit of a weird trade, but I'll take it. Okay, 
Okay, you okay. can join this fight as well. Yeah, put the tanks in. It's an armored brigade. Armored division. Now it's attacking you. God no, why are you attacking over there? You idiots. I'm supposed to fight over here. That's the coal and the key. Okay, one percent here. Yeah, they're breaking through our tanks. Or is that doing a pretty decent, decent damage? I just wish we had a bit more of a leverage here. Well, wish I knew would be granted because this is looking much better. Okay, the free. Okay, now we have a. They don't have a commander here. Oh! Okay, that's exciting. 44. Okay, well. I'll take it. You can join in with more units. Okay, we also influence the nations which we wanted to. Not that it would help. Okay, manpower is increasing, which is nice. Can we get to large military spending? It's free extra billion. Well, the defenses are shattered. It's a good strike. Armored Brigade. Armored Division. Hmm. Modern 3D printing has been finished. I'm thinking we stop the attack and start it again with the tank divisions. Because that's the primary and strongest attack that we can muster. Okay, so you guys are defending. You can join in. And you. And you can also join in. I think this is the maximum damage we can do. Oh yeah, look at that. So these are the heavy... heavy hitters. Okay, uh, so we finished the modern 3D printing. Which is nice, but... That is about it. More recon is unnecessary. You are ahead of time. We don't need anything here. 
You are all ahead of time. Helicopters are ahead of time. You are Wow, Franco ahead of time. Okay, human imitation AI. Production efficiency cap plus 5% and reset speed plus 3%. Human imitation AI expands off the deep learning concept that expands on the idea that the AI can eventually mimic human emotions and thought. Okay, there's only three divisions here, all of them American. We have air superiority here. Russia! Oh yes, Russia. Not exactly in Iran, but look at those casualties. They're pretty decent at least. Nothing else. I think we're gonna end the episode here. Uh, they lost 114,000 men, we lost 7,500. So, so far, so good. But I'm not sure if you're hopeful. I am hopeful, but. Well, we're not making much progress so far. The Americans are holding these lines. I think there's no tomorrow. This they are out of supply. You know what I could do? Oh, I'm doing that already. I'm more position priority. Okay. I was thinking we could supply them, but yeah, no. Anyway, thank you very much for joining me and I'll see you in the next episode.